So being yourself with your family. Um, some of you feel completely yourself with your family already. Your family is, you know, one of the sources of strength and stability and love and acceptance and all of that. And I just want to say congratulations. That's fantastic. So, you know, this video may not apply to you. Um, for others, they really feel challenged to be themselves with family. And I really want us to stop for a moment and consider the question before we even say being myself with family who are you i really who are you and a lot of us lock up at that kind of question so oh my god do i even know who i am or you know what is the final answer or this or that please don't worry about that from a mindfulness perspective, you are not one thing. You've never been one thing. You are in the present moment. Who are you right now? Who are you right now? And now, and now. So you get to flow and you get to change. You don't have to come up with a one size fits all answer. Who am I? But there is that question of how to allow that flow to happen with family. And family can be sticky, can be very sticky because you know each other too well. You've been around each other so long and having those primary patterns get formed in the family, then sometimes you feel like there's not room to grow and flow and change. So please really contemplate what do you need in that moment with family? And sometimes it is to withdraw. And I don't mean forever necessarily, although in some situations it's very wise, rare situations, but just to pull back enough to Feel yourself again. Remember, being who you are is a living experience. So you have to remind yourself where you're at, what that flow is, what it really feels like to be genuine. Then enter back in. This is when things get really challenging, right? Step out, then come back in when you feel that connection again. Then step out again if you have to, then step back in. Step out for quite a while if you need to, then step back in. And again, in those rare situations, don't step back in. Not this time around. Just let it go and, and work on that connection. So it's not, it's not them. I want to say this. It's up to us. We have to care for ourselves. You say, well, I don't want it. I, I want it to be that they care for me. Well, it's your life. It's not their life. It's yours. It's, it's yours to work with. It's yours to take care of. This is really good news. It's up to us and we can step out, come back in, step out, come back in and learn how to be in that flow in the present moment where our genuine self comes forward. 